Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Chow Vinsung. Welcome to the Healthy Eyes, Healthy Life series. Do you notice that your eyes are watery? Watery eyes are a common problem and there are many reasons for watery eyes. Tears are important to keep our eyes healthy and moist. They are produced by the lacrimal gland located at the outer part of the upper eyelid and drain into small openings called panta at the inner corner of the eyelid. After entering the panta, tears then travel through small ducts in the eyelid into the lacrimal sac. Finally, they then drain into the nasal lacrimal duct to the back of the nose and throat. Without sufficient tears, our eyes become uncomfortable and our vision gets blurry. However, too much tears also make our eyes watery and blur our vision. Surprisingly, dry eyes can cause watery eyes. When the eyes are dry, the brain responds by sending signals to stimulate tear production and moisturize the eye. This is a process called reflex tearing. Please watch this video to find out more about dry eyes. Allergies, conjunctivitis, blepharitis, and any condition that irritates the eyes can also cause reflex tearing. Please watch these videos to find out more about these common eye conditions. If the tear drainage system is partially or completely blocked, tears cannot drain normally and may overflow. This can be due to aging, infection or injury. The eyes become watery and irritated and this may also result in infection. Surgery to correct this creates a new pathway which bypasses the blocked duct and drains tears directly from the lacrimal sac to the nose. Some people choose not to have surgery, but without surgery, they will continue to have watery eyes, discharge, eye irritation, and would also be at a risk of infection. If the eyelids are loose and do not sit well on the eyeball, tears cannot drain into the puncta, resulting in watery eyes. This is a condition called actropion. Conversely, the eyelids may also turn inwards a condition called entropion. The interning eyelashes can irritate the eyes, resulting in reflex tearing. They can also result in infections of the cornea, which is the transparent structure in the front of the eye. Surgery can correct these eyelid problems and relieve your eye discomfort. If your eyes are very watery and affect your quality of life, please see an eye doctor for a thorough examination. There are many causes of watery eyes and it is important to treat the underlying cause. I hope that you enjoyed this video about watery eyes. Please subscribe to our channel to learn more about other important eye conditions. Till then, I wish you healthy eyes and a healthy life.